Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please stick around. I'm back y'all and it's been quite an interesting few weeks. So let's catch up. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button, stick around, follow up with my other um, videos so that you can understand what today is going to be about. You'll want to watch those videos first so you can have kind of a background. If you already follow me, thank you for following me. I know we have some new subscribers. Thank you for joining me. I am all about being down to earth and kind of telling my story and my journey in all things adulthood and all things womanhood. I don't plan on making this video very long, so if you're interested in finding out where I've been for the past month, then stick around and I will be happy to share everything with you. All right, you guys, so um, like I said previously, I have been away for a month. I haven't been able to upload anything within that time frame because a lot of things have been happening behind the scenes. It's that very difficult to uh, schedule, you know, the filming and the editing and all of that. So first things first, where have I been? What has happened? I have, you guys already know my struggle with like anemia and irregular cycles and all of that. And if you don't know and it's your first time here, please, Go back to my channel and listen to my story and uh, my my story on birth control and irregular periods and all of that. Um, that will give you an understanding of my uh, health problems and I just hope that um, it helps you understand and, it, and it, it relates to you in some kind of way or level. I have been, you know, following up with my doctors regarding my anemia situation. It's been a lot of back-to-back -back appointments. I've had appointments for IV iron infusions. That was quite the lengthy process only because that takes about two hours total to get done altogether. And so it, you know, it's really scary because uh, you just never know what could happen. Sometimes your veins don't work the way they should. So that has been a process. Um, after getting that done though, I had an asthma attack and that for me was horrible and it lasted about three weeks. I ended up going to the emergency room twice because nothing was working. Not my nebulizers, not my... Um, asthma pump and the prednisone that they gave me was a short dosage that I ended up going back to the emergency room to get another dosage of prednisone because it was really just so intense and I couldn't breathe. Um, it wasn't COVID related. It was just an asthma attack. The doctor told me it was due to the weather change, which for me, it made a lot of sense because I am highly allergic to pollen, ragweed, um, grass. There's a lot of like things out there. I have really bad seasonal allergies um, as well as different types of allergies, but those are like the really big ones. Ragweed, pollen, all that stuff. So whenever the times change every fall, it usually happens where I get an asthma attack sometimes. It happens sometimes it doesn't this time it did and unfortunately it lasted me three weeks I was in bed for a long time on top of that when I started to feel better um, Carlos took me out to eat and we got food poisoning somehow and it was really crazy because it was one of our favorite spots in the world and we ended up getting food poisoning me more than him it wasn't anything like like we weren't throwing up that wasn't it it was actually the opposite it was like thank god we have two bathrooms because i felt like i was running to the bathroom every 30 minutes and like my stomach just would not settle so it took us a couple days to recover from that because it was really really bad 
we drank loads and loads amounts of like ginger ale and had toast and lots and lots of Lipton soup because that's the only thing that I could have. Uh, mainly me more than him because he was able to recover fairly quickly. But after food poisoning that I finally started to feel better, I had a lot of, you know, doctor's appointments and follow-ups. So whenever I wanted to film and upload a new video, it was really difficult to do it because of my schedule. And now I have my little brother in here who is who I'm his thing with me for a while until I help him with his schoolwork. And so that's been a little bit crazy too, trying to juggle helping him with schoolwork, my doctor's appointments, cooking for the family, making sure dinner was on the table, struggling with my body and all these things that have been happening to me. Just giving you guys really just a short version because the long version can get really extensive. Um, I've spent this past month, I spent most of my time really just resting, uh, really resting, taking my time. I had gained so much weight because of COVID-19 that I told Carlos we need to refocus and get back to eating healthy uh, the way we used to and thankfully it has worked in my favor. The last doctor's appointment that I went to, I found out that I lost six pounds and I was so excited about it. So, you know, eating properly, just changing a lot of things that I'm doing in the house, a lot of foods, swapping a lot of foods, making sure that we eat high proteins, low carb. I, I eat a, a lot of meat. Um, but I'm not a red meat eater, which I probably should be, especially with the whole anemia thing. Um, but even that is a little bit under control right now. And with me seeing a specialist, all of that is being taken care of. So um, it's been quite the roller coaster trying to kind of juggle everything and make sure that I have content for you guys and so with my body feeling as sick as it did and as bad as I did it was really hard to sit down and take the time to record anything it didn't matter what it what I wanted it to record it was just really hard to get down to it and really put content out there for you guys you can't really do that when your body is fighting against you. So many things that I want to share with you guys that it is very difficult to do it when your body is working against you. So with me feeling ill and everything like that, it just took forever. I felt like it took forever for me to actually fully recover and feel myself. So I decided to film today because we actually got out of the house to uh, run some errands and I was like you know what as dark and windy and cloudy and rainy as it is outside I'm gonna get pretty for me because I haven't put makeup on or done my hair in a long time like I'll always blow dry my hair but today I like ironed it a little bit made it a little bit presentable for you guys and decided to put on a little bit of makeup for me because I've been uh, I haven't worn a lot of makeup you know these days so that's kind of what's been going on with me i am really excited because my birthday's coming up yay i am reaching my mid 30s and it's crazy to think that that i'm reaching my mid 30s and you know now is when i'm entering this whole journey of motherhood i'm pretty proud of myself because my whole entire goal was to focus on myself, focus on work, focus on school if I wanted to do school, and just figure me out before I ventured into motherhood and ventured into a journey um, that I knew was going to be long and extensive and it wasn't going to be about me. It was going to be about other tiny humans coming into this world. So. 
I feel like now I'm ready. I mean, I've been ready for five years. I've been ready for five years. But uh, things happen when when they happen. It, it happens in, a, you know, in the right time. And the time is now. If you want to know more about that journey, watch my other videos and you'll see what I'm talking about. So coming up, the next few vlogs that I will be doing will be, um, I will be showing you my birthday preparations, what I'm doing, all of that. And I will be vlogging my birthday party as well. So strictly friends, no family, um, bec only because my birthday usually falls on Thanksgiving. This year it doesn't. This year is the Monday before Thanksgiving and then that Thursday is Thanksgiving. So for me, it's going to be quite the domino effect and I am going to vlog all of it and show you guys what Thanksgiving is going to be about. Um, which I'm pretty excited because we always do a feast. So I look forward to showing you guys all my Thanksgiving preparations and sharing recipes and just showing you what I do and what I love to do every year. And I only do it on Thanksgiving because that is really a Thanksgiving meal. And Thanksgiving in my house, even though I do a big feast on one day, my food will last me for a whole week after. And it's great because I don't have to cook. So that is su super awesome. I will be showing some, sharing some Thanksgiving recipes and I'm really excited to share that with you. Also, I was thinking about doing a Vlogmas. I've never done that this, you know, ever in my channel. And because this is the first time that I actually have activity and I'm putting content out there, you know, I, I started this channel back in 2017. I wasn't ready and this year I've really taken the reins and put content out there. Um, there's a lot more content you know to be made and shared with you and be put out there so if you like the idea of vlogmas let me know i will definitely get something started for december maybe do something like 25 days of christmas or something um or 25 days of um holiday festivities but that's kind of where I'm at right now. That's kind of where I have been. I am back. I'm ready to get some content out there. I'm ready to get to know you better and share whatever it is that I'm feeling, whether it's a short vlog or a long vlog. And that's kind of where I'm at. So if you've watched this video to the end, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you so much for following along in my journey. I hope to inspire you and relate to you on a more personal level. And I hope uh, to relay to everyone watching that you can do anything you set your mind to. It just, you know, sometimes it takes time. It takes the perfect timing and your timing will never be wrong and it will never be off because it is your timing um thank you guys so much for tuning in if you like this video please hit the like button share it with your friends also don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss my next few videos and don't forget to turn on your post notifications on by hitting the bell button next to the subscribe button Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope to see you next time. Love you and have a good night.